Governor, you watched this speech. You noticed that it contained almost no political meat at all. It was all about her husband, the president. Was that the right way to go? Sure. I think, first of all, the country loves Michelle Obama, and this helps the president widen the likability gap. I mean, you saw Michelle Obama there. She's every person's idea of what an American mom should be. So it widens the likability gap, and that's very, very important for us. Number two, she made the case to the American people how Barack Obama worries every night about ordinary citizens, about finding people jobs. And I think that's important to, to, to let the American people know that the president does feel their pain, that the president works as hard as he can to try to alleviate things. I think it was an incredible look into the president as an individual, their family, and I think even critics of Barack Obama say he's a great family man. And Michelle Obama reinforced that today unbelievably well. We know that she is a woman with strong political opinions, but of course she doesn't express it. Right. Well, she expressed a few tonight. You know, she talked about the things that the president's been able to do to bring health care to ordinary people, uh, to create new jobs. And I think she really believes that he's got the country going on the right track. But the most important thing tonight is reinforce Barack Obama, the great family man, the love of her life, and the likable Barack Obama, the likable Michelle Obama. That's worth gold in politics. What does it mean in terms of, say, a vote, a women's vote? Well, I think she made a very strong and persuasive case to women just by standing up and saying the things she said that are important to ordinary women, uh, I think gives a strong message to women. Uh, but she was terrific, and, and to, mostly to working moms, and not just working moms, but to ordinary stay-at-home moms. She created a picture of an American family that, that's just about as good as it gets. Governor Ed Reddell, former governor of Pennsylvania, former chair of the party, thank you so much. I will much. tell you, we just heard the best speech of the convention.